What's up guys, this video is about us packing, what we're bringing to Canada, and how we're doing it. For this trip specifically, we are packing one suitcase for both Mary and I. Landon will have his own suitcase because we want to bring a lot of clothes for him because it is winter. Um, it'll be his first full-blown winter in the snow in the very frigid, freezing tundra of Canada. Yeah. It's not that cold, but... Uh, it is cold for us local Hawaiian people. So, without further ado, this is what we are packing. This is everything we have here. We are fitting in one suitcase. This is Reed's stuff. This is my stuff. This is going to be for our Canada trip for the 10 days that we're going to be there. We will be um, washing one time. We have one hotel or Airbnb that we have, we are able to wash at. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start with my stuff. So I'm going to show you guys what's in my packing cubes. All right, so here, this is pretty much my main outfits. I have all of my pants and tops here. I'm bringing these are all pretty much black pants. I have one, two, three, four, five. And then I have my underlayer. This is a top and bottom underlayer. This is just from Target. And then I have my tops here. I have one, two, three, four. So I'm bringing four different shirts. In this packing cube, I just have my undergarments, pretty much my underwear, my bra, and then I have a beanie, my socks in here as well, and oh, this is a beanie as well. So I have two beanies that I'm bringing. I have one, two, three, four, five pairs of socks, and this is kind of like a, what is this called, babe? This is for pretty much like covering your mouth and your nose or in the cold. Or or yeah, or something like that. Kind of like a scarf, but it's covering your mouth and like your nose area so you're not freezing. And I have one piece of bathing suit in here. We might go to a hot springs. And then, yeah, that's it. My underwear and my bra. Here in this plastic ziplock, I have my heavy coat. And this is, it's from Columbia. You guys will see this in my photos and videos. But right now I have it in like a super tight, airtight ziplock that I don't want to open because it took me so long to put it in here. And I just have this one infinity scarf. I'm bringing two pairs of gloves. I have my pretty much everyday walking around Vancouver area. And then this is going to be for Whistler. It's a little, it's thicker and it'll be great for snow. Then I have my toiletry case right here. This is a foldable backpack. And this is a foldable duffel bag, which I always bring this or bring something like this so I can put all my dirty clothes in. And lastly, this is my makeup bag. You're probably wondering why I don't have any shoes in my suitcase. That's because I'm going to be wearing this to the airport already. And this is the only shoes I'll be bringing throughout our trip. This is a white... Um, waterproof boots from Columbia and super comfy. I'm not sure what exactly it's called, but I'll have the link below. Hey guys, this <laughs> is my stuff and it's messy. I know it's not up to part of Mary's, but hey, okay, so here we go. We got the North Face jacket, it's waterproof. We got some t shirts one, two, three, four. Four t-shirts, we good to go. Got a nice dress shirt for them nice nights out, you know what I'm saying? One, two, pull over, um, what are these called, babe? Flannels. Flannels, we got some flannels. Flannels from a manos, you know what I'm saying? You ain't a man if you don't got no flannels. The bottom there, we got the belt. We got some tight fitted chino, what are these called? Chinos, I guess you could call them chinos. Another pair, and then we got two pairs of jeans. 
my ideal goal is to layer them, you know, when it's a little cold, just a little bit. <laughs> my swim shorts, my sleep shorts, my all kind of shorts, they're hurlies, they dry extremely fast and well. So I figure, you know, if, if I really have to worst case scenario wash them, just sink it is. The gloves and the beanie and the baraclava, I think it's called. I know baklava is actually like a food, but so yeah, this thing is probably one of the coolest things I own. I love it. I'm gonna be wearing a beanie and my gloves. Now we got some undies. My scarf. Oh, by the way, the gloves are Gore-Tex. Really amazing stuff. Socks. I'm only bringing two pairs. I figure we're not really gonna need a lot since it'll be cold. Got wool socks. Two pairs also. The shoes that I'll be wearing with these socks actually will be these. These are Forsake shoes. Boop, 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 boop. Winterproof, waterproof, nice proof. Necessity toiletry, toiletry bag, separate video. Check it out what's in there. Under layers here. And I'm bringing three pencil layers. These are actually the ones I want to layer underneath my jeans when I go snowboarding. And now we're gonna try to fit everything in in our Delcy suitcase. This is the suitcase we're bringing. We have the Delcy Cherry suitcase. This is one of their check-in suitcases. We're gonna be sharing this. If you wanna know more about this, like the sizing and everything, I'll have it listed on the blog as well, along with all the clothes we're bringing. So this is gonna be Reed's side of the suitcase, and this is gonna be my side of the suitcase. Oh,